Hi and welcome to part 13 of the building SS using Django and Vue.js. Today I'm going to do some stuff all around the site and I'm going to begin with creating a new page for plans. So I go to the core and inside the views here I create the view first, def, plans, request, return, render, request, core, plans.html then I can import that to SKNIL URLs and add it here path plans plans name is also plans and I can import that from here like that then I can just close the URLs and the views and I can go to templates base.html. I want to show this only if I'm not authenticated. Div class navbar start a href URL plans class navbar item plans so I want to have a page for showing pricing and what you can get for the different packages Pause. okay just a typo template doesn't exist that's okay so then I can go up here create a new file plans.html just copy this plans create some columns here columns is multi line dev class column is 12 okay then I want to create I want to have two different plans Here I want to create a card from Bulma. Always forget how to create them. Div class card. Div class card content. Media Dev class it's media content V class title is for basic and below I add this sure that it looks okay yes perfect and when you get the basic package you get five categories and 50 bookmarks Then I can copy this pro, then you have 50 categories and 
and limited bookmarks is offset to make it uncentered. Okay, I don't want to do anything more here for a while. So I can go back here and check out the next task, which is to create a new user profile model. Then I stop the server, Python, manage, start app. Apps, sorry, I need to create a folder first. Apps, user profile, Python, manage, start app. Let's call user profile located in apps slash user profile. Can go back here again. Inside here, I need to add this to the list of installed apps. User profile. Save. Then I can open the model to create the user profile class user profile models dot model I need a reference to the user I need a model dot no models dot one to one key user related name user profile on delete models.cascade. So when you delete the user, you also delete the user profile. I need to import the user model, which I do from, from Django.contrib.auth.models in import user. And I also need to make it possible to have a reference to these two packages. Basic, basic, I just create some constants here. Pro, choices, plans, create a tuple with the tuples inside. This is just a label for the admin interface. Plan equals models to char field max length twenty choices choices plans and default equals basic. So then we can save this and add it to the user. No, sorry, add it to the database. Make migrations. One to one key. Okay, I probably misspelled that. Django one to one field, of course. Yeah, Python manage migrate. Then I can run the server again. I want to import this to show it in the admin interface from dot models import admin dot site dot register user profile so if I go to the admin and sign in like that I can create a new user profile for this user then I want to log out and I can log in with this user. Okay, and then I can go back here again, set this to done. But I also make, need to make sure that this user profile is created when we sign up a user. So here under sign up, I import the model from apps dot user profile dot models import user profile and I can create it here user profile 
it to your profile dot object dot create user equals user and that's it because the basic package will be added at default so then I can close this done done and also I want to make it possible to change which plan you are using under the settings page settings I want to make it possible to add payment later but for now I just want to make it possible to change which plan you are on for free label class label plan Dave class control Dave class select Select option value basic basic option value pro pro also I need to add the name plan and I need to check here if the plan is selected if request user dot user profile dot plan equals basic selected equals selected as you can see I can just say user dot user profile because I use the one to one field I can save this and go and test it. So it selected basic and it set selected to the basic. That means that it's working. So I can close this. And in the back end, I need to get this data. Plan request the post get plan user that user profile dot plan equals plan user dot user profile dot save then we can see if this is working yeah now we are pro perfect and that was it for this video. In the next video, I'm going to make it possible to start implementing stuff using the plan so that when I'm just a basic user, I will only make it possible to add five categories and similar.